Right boys, we're back, it's a new day, and we're on day 29 of building an eight-figure e-commerce brand. No one's documenting this. Hopefully we can do it. Obviously it's probably gonna be a long journey. So I would advise subscribe. You're probably thinking, if you're new here, why would you subscribe, why would you follow? Um, I've got a track record. I built and exited a company the last three years in e-commerce, did over like 3.4 million in sales and then exit it for a big cash amount. So can I do this again? I'm not sure, I think I can. So we're gonna go from that. There's been some big changes so far as well. I've done a few notes um, and these little talks are basically like me documenting my progress on the reality of like building this company, building this brand. And it's not a fast procedure because it's not drop shipping. We're doing custom products, custom stock, custom photo shoots, whatever. Um, the lot, we're going full in, we're putting in cash investment, everything. Um, so we're doing this properly. properly. So some of the money uh, I sold the company with previously, I'm putting into this one. So hopefully it goes well. So the updates as follows. Firstly, you can see I've got a new background. Just, just landed in Bali, gassed, feeling dope as soon as I got here. Got sun already, getting the tan back, feeling good. Bali's a great place for me personally. And um, yeah, the boys are here as well, so it's super good. But I'm actually filming um, with all the guys here again. So that's kind of awkward for me, but we're back in the game, we're running it anyway. So number one, today I'm gonna break down like what costs I've spent so far and what have I done so far. And again, like I said last time, urgency is like the main thing right now. So I just dropped 2.5K on a domain because I was set on this domain being the one for the brand. <clears throat> Obviously you don't need to do this if you're starting out, but I wanted this name and it's 2.5K, which is within my budget. Um, if it was like 10K, I wouldn't have bought it. Obviously that's stupid, but it's one of those things that in three years down the line, if I wanted that name, I would have regretted it. So I've got to buy it if it works out, obviously. I use GoDaddy for that. And then I also just dropped 1.2K on an Instagram name. So the Instagram name was not available, but I put a tweet out and a couple of people reached out to me. They can basically do this thing where they claim Instagram names that are inactive. Um, so it was an inactive profile that had a name. So we should be able to make the claim. We should be able to get it. Um, yeah, spent 1.2K on that. So hopefully we get it, we'll see, um, because I need the Instagram name and the domain to be connected. Obviously I wouldn't have bought, I have to have both to buy them both. I wouldn't have just bought one without the other. So let's see how that goes. Still waiting on the guy to see if we got it. I've only paid him 50% so far. Regarding stock, um, so far I've purchased one product, but I'm gonna be building a catalog of like eight products, but so far I just purchased one. Um, I've dropped $2,000 on a stock yeah, before Chinese New Year, because I had to order something before Chinese New Year, because Chinese New Year was coming up, so that's what I was on about, like, urgency. So I dropped 2K on stock, um, just to get something on the line. Um, and I've got five samples coming to me in Bali, and then the rest of the, I think it was like 300 units or something, the rest of the products are going to the UK, um, because I was just speed, 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 didn't have a fulfillment center or anything, but I'm sending it to, like, my little unit in the UK, where I've got people that will sort it out. Um, so we've got a tiny batch of stock in the UK. I've got samples in Bali. The, the progress now to get things off the ground is I've organized and hired a videographer and photographer, which will do a photo shoot next week, which the price is variable. Um, we probably won't get into that now. And we've got two models and we're gonna plan and organize a shoot compared to what we wanna film and brand the, the company compared with other successful companies but with our own USPs. So the USPs I'm not gonna go into yet, maybe when I release the company name, I will once, once things are flowing. So photo shoot booked, samples arriving in like two days. The photographer and videographer are managing the models, the locations, etc. I'm just giving the money because I don't wanna focus on that right now. Um, and that's where we're currently at. I also have hired I've also hired a right-hand man. So I've hired someone to just be working with me, doing stuff I don't need to do. So paying people, obviously I've got two companies, I've got the network and building this e-com brand. So I've hired a right-hand man to help me manage things. He's helping me pay people, he's helping me manage my emails, DMs, etc., And he's also helped me kick this brand off the start. So things are quicker. If you have another person working with you to just execute with you, things are gonna be quicker. So we check in every day. 
And what we have started on so far is fulfillment centers. So originally I thought I would have the unit in the UK to ship things, but the people that were doing that are on holiday for the first month. So again, speed, speed, speed is the first thing. So we've had to find a fulfillment center straight away. Usually most fulfillment centers have a minimum orders per month, like the good ones. Um, so on these meetings, we've had one meeting so far We've been accepted to it, um, but most don't want to take up startups because obviously you've got zero orders. We've got zero orders, so most people don't want to work with you. But what we did is I explained, look, I'm a serial e-com entrepreneur, effectively. I've sold a company. We've got cash investment. This is going to be a big brand. All we need to do right now is send a small test batch to you, get that moving, and then we'll send a big batch of units once the ads and sales are running. They were like asking our like sales plans, etc. That's all good. So we've been approved for one. So we had a call with James and James Fulfillment. They seem pretty good. They're a bit more expensive, but there's some big brands working with them. Um, so they seem like a good option because they've got USA Fulfillment and UK. Um, I'm planning to attack the USA, maybe do a bit of UK, we'll see. Um, but yeah, my right hand man has been helping me book meetings with fulfillment centers, organizing all that. Um, we got the Shopify set up as well. I was running a previous store on that. So it was just organizing some bits on that, transferring the domains, etc. cetera. Um, and he's just gonna be involved with everything, managing my main business and managing my new startup. And it should improve everything. So, so far with domain, Instagram, stock, I also bought packaging as well. That was $300. And that's both gonna go to the fulfillment center as soon as possible, hopefully in the next two weeks. So domain, Instagram name, stock, packaging, and right-hand man hand hire, that's about, what is that? So the camera literally just shut off. Um, don't know why, I think I've done some new settings because obviously you can see like the style is different as well. But I've done some new settings. But what I was doing and talking about was calculating like the total amount I've dropped. So 2K plus 1.2K is 3.2K, plus another 2K, that's 5.2, plus 500, that's 5.7K and then like 300 on packaging. So I've spent $6,000 so far, oh, plus 800, $6,800 so far, but 60% of that is money spent on stuff you don't need to spend on. So Instagram profile, domain, but that's important to me and what I wanted to do. You can get a domain for $5. So this was just the one I want to do. You can get an Instagram name for free, but that was the one I wanted to do. So that's my situation so far. Regarding the steps moving forward, like I said, hopefully we'll get the shoot done next week. I still need to do the mood board and product design. Regarding getting things moving even quicker is Chinese New Year's happening right now. I wanna design the full catalog and of the products completely finished in the next three weeks while Chinese New Year's done. So when the manufacturers open up, I can send the full catalog and start getting complete samples of everyone. Because last series I was basically talking about, I wanna get samples of loads of manufacturers because I still don't know if any of these manufacturers are good. I haven't had a sample yet, they arrive next week. Um, but again, I want the best of the best. Um, so once I design this catalog, I'll start sending samples off while the fulfillment center is shipping and we're selling and got the photo shoot done. So that initial photo shoot and the fulfillment center selling that like 300 units, that's just to get the foot in the door, build the website, get the momentum going, then we'll like $50 a day on ad spend to just get some sales ticking over, one or two sales a day, I don't care, whatever. While the samples and other manufacturing companies are sending us the new products and we'll bulk buy like legit amount. That's the dog barking in the background, just to say, which is good to have, have her back. So yeah, juggling multiple things at once, small batch of stock going to fulfillment center, photo shoot happening for that, starting to design the new catalog now which will be finished when chinese new year happens so we should be able to get samples done within three weeks and have all the stock ready within eight weeks max selling it shipped whatever also i want to find a proper packaging person where i can get legit good packaging the packaging order we just made was more quick easy it was more expensive but they're good good quality packaging but it's not exactly what we want and it was a small amount. So once we know exactly what we want and everything's designed properly, we'll go there. Right now, I'm just putting into the pieces so things happen and sales are coming through the door. I've also started speaking with like future hire pe people, hires that I wanna talk to, um, such as emails, Google ads, all of that. I'll be running the Facebook ads, I'll do the uh, other stuff. And we're also looking at more videographers, more photographers, content creators to like work with us continuously. 
So yeah, I'm hyped. The goal of this, obviously you can see the title, raw update building a 10 mil e-com brand. Within three years, I want to do 10 mil in revenue. I want to turn this to eight figure brand. I want to turn this into an eight figure a year brand. And we're going to do that. I'm pretty sure of it. So if you're new here, I appreciate your time. Click the subscribe button because it's going to be dope. I want to also, actually, I forgot to say this, I'm dropping a fat series. Six to eight episodes of me, the complete zero to 100, building and exited my last dropshipping brand. Um, so I'll start filming that like next week. Other things that are coming up. Uh, definitely going to do more like vlog style stuff because people like the Bali footage. People like hanging out with the boys. We're going to do some trips. Just more casual stuff. And then I've also got a case study because we just scaled a store to 100K a month. Literally hit $100,000 last month. It's a brand new store, custom products, everything. And the growth is insane and the ROAS is insane. I'm going to drop a case study on that for Tuesday. Um, but yeah, that's everything that's going on. If you want to join the free Discord, all the stuff's below. Peace.